Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to print photos on the Canon TS6220. Obviously, first we need to power it on. Press the power button. Go ahead and open up the control panel and pull out the tray. So for photos, we have to, if, if it is anything but a standard sheet of paper, if it's glossy or if it's a smaller card, we have to feed it through the rear feeder. So let's go ahead and open that up by lifting up, opening that. You always insert the print side of the paper facing out. Just like that and close it. Now we have to tell the printer what type of paper we've loaded. So it's showing 5x7, which is what I inserted, and it's glossy, so that is correct. So we're just going to hit yes. Okay, so now I'm going to go to my computer, and I'm going to print out a photo. You have to tell your computer to print from the rear feeder. It is glossy paper, and then you have to tell it the size of the paper as well. So let me go ahead and do that. Okay, I just now hit print, and it's printing, it's sending, there we go. Obviously for photos it's going to print slower because the entire surface is being covered with ink versus just a text document. Okay. Ideally, you should, you should let the photo dry, depending on the type of paper you have. Okay, so that looks amazing. Let's do a close-up of that. And yeah, that looks really good. Um, one last tip is if you're printing from a word processor or maybe a web browser, and you have the image in the document, like a text, you know, a Word document, the computer, the printer might think that it is a text document, so it's going to print out the picture, the black, using a pigment ink instead of a, um, a dye ink. So the pigment ink will not match like the re reflective capabilities of the dye ink that the colors are using. And the pigment ink tends to smear sometimes if it doesn't dry you know, within 24 hours. So it's important that you either use a photo viewer or maybe tell the Word document that you're printing a photo instead of a document. That way the printer uses a dye black and not the pigment black because this printer has both types of black in it. Thank you for watching.